They called it a joke, but it's no joke to their bosses. An insensitive photo is making the rounds on the internet, and now a group of Toronto garbage collectors is facing the consequences. CTV's Natalie Johnson explains. It was a tragic scene that devastated a community just this past March. A five-year-old girl walking home from school was struck by a City of Toronto garbage truck. Kaylee callahan Belanger died at the scene. And that is in part why, when this photo hit the web, city officials were not impressed. This is the act of morons. Uh, they should know better. The photo posted on the site Reddit shows a child-sized dummy crunched into the door of the garbage truck. Okay, so our name's on. Public Works Chair Denzel Minnan Wong says the operators of the truck have been taken off the road as the city investigates. The contractor has to act in a professional manner, and clearly this isn't the case. In a statement to CTV, the CEO of GFL Environmental, the company contracted to pick up garbage west of Young, said GFL regrets the actions of its employees and will take appropriate discipline against the employees involved, adding it apologizes for any offense caused by this incident. Comments posted online sarcastically read, customer service excellence, and they have a great sense of humor, though one person accuses Torontonians of being oversensitive. But it's not an issue of being oversensitive to the people in the community where the five-year-old girl was killed just a few months ago, who say the photo is far from funny. So that's disgusting. I think that's horrible. You know what? That is in poor taste. The city says GFL has been performing well since the company took over garbage collection west of Young last summer, saving the city $11 million a year and eliciting fewer service calls. But they call this incident a very serious matter, exceedingly bad judgment that will be punished. Natalie Johnson, CTV News.